guys don't get it. You don't get it. What part don't we get? Ask everyone in this room. I'll bet you they all get it. I I'd like to speak. We have one of the highest unemployment rates in the country here in Cherokee County. Our people are unemployed and hungry. Where are you getting the money to pay for this? I need renovations on my home. I don't have the money, so I don't do it. When you say that we're not broke, give some of the money back to the people then. Why do you have to spend this money? When a homeless shelter has a is in threat of being closed daily. I have people with me here from churches. Churches are being approached on a daily basis for food, for money, for power bills. And you, uh, sir, talked about that we have money. You, sir, talked about the dignity of the people. I speak for the dignity of the people of this area. They need jobs. Look at Brothers Landing. Look how it's closed down. Look at the houses that are for sale or the houses that are being foreclosed. Okay, we do need a courthouse, I totally agree with you, but the people of Murphy and the surrounding areas are hurting. They need your help, not your expenditure on a courthouse. And that has nothing to do with the statute. I, I'm just saying that every foreclosure that I've ever seen, and, and I do, I, I, I'm going to look at one after we get out of this meeting, has been handled through a realtor. Lawrence, is that correct? Yes. Which is also another point because it has nothing to do with you. But one reason fighting with me was waste after the deal was done, on and on, and then who was involved? Perception. We have the perception. We've got big problems in this county, and if there's not adequate communication to and from, you're going to always have the perception. Uh, and as you found out, the voting you. You're always going to have problems, whether it's you or whether it's the new ones coming in. It is not going to change unless this perception changes. We have been open and inviting the public to a meeting since the day. There's a perception problem. Mm -hmm. And I think I was very valid in bringing up that perception without the facts behind it to sit here and say, that doesn't smell good. And we always invited to her that we had that all these discussions about the purpose of the building and all the stuff that we've talked about went on at meetings that were held when there were two people or three people sitting here. Why in the last six months of your terms do you all of a sudden start spending money? <coughs> and I've already heard in the paper from one of you, and that is just not good enough. Why can you not default for six months? and give it to the new commissioners to, to have. Here, here. One of the bottom of a, a economic collapse. I don't see how you say we have the money. Right. Everyone yeah, knows that. Money. The whole country is on the verge of economic Look, collapse. Look, you property tax. Can I hear you? Can I hear you? Uh, since we're talking about the bottom of an economic collapse, uh, it seems to me that real estate prices have bottom and absolutely dropped out of it. As I had predicted back in 2007, when I circulated my petition protesting the revaluation, we got 2,700 signatures of angry citizens or angry landowners that uh, had a revaluation four years earlier than was required by law, and that uh, has, was at the peak of the real estate bubble. And the next year, the bottom it started dropping. So we're going to get some reimbursement back. From. Where do you think they get the money to reimburse you? Uh, that, I, I'm just saying the, the county is going to be is going to get reimbursed for you know how much um, it's about 50% um, uh, of the cost how do we get reimbursed on depreciation that that is a cost of um, providing space for uh, depreciation depreciation is a Accounting term. I know. I'm a degree accountant. I've worked in Carpenter America. Right. There's 500 different ways of depreciation. Uh, and that's the state allows depreciation as a cost of providing service. And they reimburse us for that. Boy, uh, does our state need to, there's a whole lot of stuff need cleaning up if we get paid on depreciation. Uh, that, <laughs> That, Depreciation is basically the consumption of an asset. And if we get paid for consuming an asset, boy, we need a whole lot of people <laughs> to do it, don't we? 